Today, Farming Simulator announced a new crop and harvest dynamic for Farming Simulator 25 on their YouTube channel. I'm bringing you this from my new farm here on the map Kalinovka in the new FS22 series here on my channel. We've got new episodes every Monday and Friday, so check out the channel for this and other FS22 series. Enough on that though, so back to the news on Farming Simulator 25. Today they announced the spinach crop for FS25 and the unique way in which it will be harvested and stored. And that is that you won't be storing it. In FS25, spinach is a fresh crop, and so you'll need to sell it or use it right away. There's no news yet on specific productions for FS25, but I'm sure the crop will have its uses, and personally, I like the idea of having one or more fresh crops. It's one more mechanic in the system, and additionally, one less crop that I'll have to keep track of in the silo and when is the best time to sell it, because, well, we'll be harvesting it and selling it right away. And not only will spinach be a fresh crop, as I mentioned, but the harvesting itself gets a new touch. We'll be able to harvest it twice, meaning that you'll be planting your spinach in April and then harvesting it in June and then again in September. I think this is something great that will keep some fun and fresh work on your farm throughout the summer while you still can't harvest most other crops. I think it's likely we'll see more crops like spinach, which will need to be used or sold while still fresh, and I think changes like this are just what makes a new installment of Farming Simulator so good and constantly evolving. I've got a link in the description to the Farming Simulator video announcing the new spinach crop. It's just a short video, but it's always great to see more footage and updates on what is looking to be an incredible installment in the Farming Simulator franchise. That's it for now, but I'll be around to give you more news, updates, and soon enough, gameplay and series from Farming Simulator 25 after its launch in November. For now, you can check out my channel, Season 29, and follow along with this farm we're working on right now. Thanks a lot for watching, for your views and subscriptions, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one, where we'll be continuing into fall here on the farm.